nest and veal at the Excalf. You, Dane, come closer. What do you want? You look to be a good fighter, but do you dare to face the greatest battle you will ever know? Of what do you speak? I speak of a terrible and monstrous incorporeal power whose name is feared across these lands. Fergal the Faceless, the most fearsome flighter in all of Grantbridgeshire. Oh. oh, a flighter, is that all? Fergal the Faceless has silenced doubters before. Will you challenge him? I will face the Faceless. <gasps> My God, you are braver than most. Or perhaps more foolish. Come, I will give you a key. This key unlocks Fergal's lair, which you see now before you. That is a house. No, no, it is a den of nightmares. A pit of death from which few have ever escaped unharmed. By words. Unharmed by words. Go, go now, and God be with you. <laughs> A new victim? What fool dares to challenge the might of Fergal the Faceless? Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor of the Raven Clan? My next meal. Are you prepared to be eviscerated with words? I think I will survive. I am Fergal the Faceless, and I am clever and strong. But you're not. You're ugly and weak, and you're a big smelly coward. You're probably too scared to even face me, now that I think about it. Sorry, have you started? Yes, obviously. I said you're probably too scared to face me. It's the weakest attempt I have yet heard to disgrace me. Ah, you think you can win with rhyme, do you? Well, if you like to rhyme, listen this time. I'm very brave. My flighting is grave. I'm not a knave, and it's victory that I really crave. Your tongue is fat. You're a sprat. You whine like a little brat. And we are in a spat. Says the flighter who hides in a hole like a rat. Oh, you've made a terrible mistake. Be ready for my finishing blow. I am the best at flighting. I have got powerful skills. I'm strong as an ox and clever as a fox. I'm sharp as a dozen hawks. Let me show you my skills, and then you I shall kill dead with my... my skill. If we are arguing as to your talent, I shall happily die on this hill. You... Uh, well... I... Uh, just one moment. I, I... I need to think. Give me time. Fergal the Faceless or Fergal the Wordless? No, you get ready. The killing blow is... It's coming. It's... Fergal? Hello?
grandfather's wallop is like none other. All it Grandfather's wallop is like none other. All it takes is one. His fist is a glorious basher of fools, full of great big scars and old dried blood. <laughs> one day I'm gonna be as strong as grandfather. I'll wallop the heads off oxen. He used... Oh, such a fine wallop it is! Little ones, what is this wallop you speak of? It's our grandfather, and be careful unless you want a walloping. I am certain my might could clove his wallop. Many cowards have said the same. He uses only one fist, one wallop, boom! Like a wolf, howling with its knuckles. Well, this wallop has me curious. Ha! Huh, good. Destiny is coming to your plate. Grandfather, there's someone looking for a walloping. Hello. Yes, I have overwhelmingly powerful strength, but it is not worth talking about. If you are Drenga, we should tell stories of battle, swill a cup of mead around the hearth, and share our wisdom. You want some wisdom? Don't become a hero like I have. I'm cursed with this wallop. These children have made me curious. Your calm demeanor, even more so. Oh, I beg you. There's no need for this to go where I feel you think it should. <laughs> you best depart unless you desire your face become a fist cave. Children, stop saying such things. I do not want to use it. I truly wish to see this wall up. I will break it with my humble fists. Oh, neither of us will enjoy this, I'm afraid. Time has come for you. There you have it, as promised. Banal victory for me and my wallop. Oh, still unbeaten. Why, God? Come back if you want another taste of my endless victory. I know I don't want you to. Don't test my... I... I have returned. I see. I suppose you want to see the wallop. Yes, it is time. I want to experience this wallop. This is a sad moment in time. Hold on to your teeth. You're finished. I'm tired. Don't say I didn't. There you have it, as promised. Banal victory for me and my wallop. Oh, still unbeaten. Why, God? Come back if you want another taste of my endless victory. I know I don't want you to. Don't test... I... I have returned. I see. I suppose you want to see the wallop. Yes, it is time. I want to experience this wallop. This is a sad moment in... That's enough! <sighs> I'm tired. <laughs> Don't say I didn't warn you. The disappointment you will feel, I also feel. There you have it. As promised, banal victory for me and my wallop. Oh, still unbeaten. Why, God? Come back if you want another taste of my endless victory. I know I don't want you to. If you want the wallop... I... I have returned. I see. I suppose you want to see the wallop. Yes, it is time. I want to experience this wallop. This is a sad moment in time. Hold on to your teeth. Cage me, O oh Lord. Don't say I didn't warn you. The disappointment you will feel, I also feel. So goes my day. Down you go. 
I've never been bested before. I'm shocked, stunned. I never thought it possible. You have thwarted my wallop. You may have access to the treasure my wallop has sadly gifted me over the years. Various awards for bashing skulls. Oh, I feel liberated of my legacy. Now I could live the normal life that has forever eluded me. Thank the heavens! Children kept the collection of those he had walloped. The treasure he promised. His wallop won him an ocean of riches. as much air as a hailstorm. You cannot be allowed to keep spewing. Did you sail through a storm? You never mentioned. Eivor! A fine day for being out, no? Soma said I would find you here, Leif. What's your plan? We're ridding the world of a priest who spouts praise for the Elderman and funnels tithes into Wickman's coffers. So the plan is this. We sneak in, gut the priest, and return to Soma. That will get Wickman steaming. As a master shipbuilder, what does your work require? Patience and love. I know each of our vessels as a parent knows their child. But building ships needs silver too. The hard wood, the tough fabrics, the expensive paints, the yellow I use, for instance, that must be imported. A high price for a happy color. I'm certain that's why someone stole my paint some weeks ago. Blasted thief. How did you come to join Soma's army? We came to England together, sailing under Guthrum. The great summer army, the Saxons called us. When Guthrum left for Wessex, Soma stepped forward to lead. Something I would have liked to do myself. And what would you do if you were the Jarl of Grandbridge? I would run the city in my own way. I would not give Birna and Galen's opinions equal weight. Do you not trust them? I wouldn't say that. It's more. Birna's boots are stuck in the mud, and Galen's are in the sky. If death were bearing down upon us, I worry neither would have what it takes to carry us through. You were there when Guthrum made Soma the steward of Grandbridge. How did that feel? Good fortune for her. When Soma took hold, the silver started flowing and the people started dancing. She knows trade. I do wish I'd been bold enough to put myself forward, to take on the burden and honor of running a city. But that's beside the point. Soma is my Jarl's corner, and I'm her sworn man. No act of any god will change that. Good conversation, Leif. Now let's take down Wickman's man. Too right, too right. Wickman's whelp awaits his reward. My warriors will distract the Saxon forces at the gate. You and I will find the priest.
You know, I would much prefer a more straightforward approach. But for you, I'll try something new. How kind. I'll keep your voice down.
Keep my wits about me. I may be a heathen in the Saxon side, but this church is not. I know good craftsmanship. <laughs> Lord Wigmund of Walden carries with him. This priest's lies will not poison the Shire anymore. We should leave. about us.
sign here. Hey! No, I scared you, yellow dog! Well struck. We made short work of Wickman's man. That we did. You've proven yourself an asset to us. I'll see you back in Grandbridge. <laughs> 